welcome my friends and viewers out there. I want to appreciate you once more for joining me in this um, show. Like I said, this is bit-sized nuggets. This is where we peruse into different information from various various platforms from great minds great authors and we bring them to you while we analyze them and use them for our profits and productivity i'm going to be talking or bringing a nugget from one of the books i i read written by Mr. Johnson Oyindamola and uh, many of us must have seen this book. The book is uh, Elevate Your Game. Elevate Your Game. I must tell you the truth. It's, it's a kind of guide for anybody that wants to become something worthy. So I must say that this book is very important for you and today i'm going to bring out something very important from this book about personal branding personal branding we are going to look at one of the things he stated here which will be of great help to us now i read from um, chapter five of his book and uh, there's something he talked about branding now, he began by saying that what is personal brand? Now, there's a difference between personal branding and personal brand. Now, your personal brand is what people say about you in your absence. Now, it reflects your ability to leverage the power of differentiation the impression that people have on you and the perception you have been able to build in the mind of your tribe and audience. Now, this is you. Like you could remember that the first, the first episode we talked about understanding you, understanding yourself, knowing yourself. So, for the fact that there is a particular way you must have built yourself, people must have known you for that particular thing. That is your personal brand. That is who you are. When you are talking about your personal brand, it is what people know you. People can say about you. Not because, not faking it, but they can say about you in your presence, in your absence, I mean. Whatever they say about you, it's who you are. And, you know, you need to check what what is it that someone can say about me in my absence it's a very important thing you need to ask yourself what can they say about you what brand have you been able to give for yourself now he went for that to make a distinct distinction because when you're not talking about personal branding personal branding is your conscious that is conscious deliberate intentional you are conscious deliberate intentional about building your brand that is personal brand is that process that lasting process you do long lasting process you do in building your brand now what brand are you building for yourself that's the question what are you building for yourself who do we know you for in your, on your various platforms your social media at home wherever you are at work who can we say you are what brand have you built for yourself many of us the reason we are in the same level we are every time is because of the brand we have built for ourselves do people trust you do people believe in your capacity and your ability these are the questions you need to ask yourself what brand are you building for yourself now take note of this it can help you build your brand what are they who are you what problems are you wired to solve now take note of that who are you what problems are you wired to solve now 
Why are you the best person to solve them? What are your superpowers? These things will help you to understand. Now, what differentiates you from others providing the same solution? What is your competitive edge? What unique and compelling story do you have to share with the world? How have you leveraged on the power of differentiation? This helps you. The moment you're able to build your brand, this will help you to be able to understand how to differentiate yourself from others. What makes you unique? What makes you unique? And that is what can come out when you're able to build your personal brand. People waste their time building so many things, but they forget that the major thing you need to build first is your brand. Now, work on your brand. Your brand is who you are. It's not what you are doing. Or what you are, it is who you are and what who you are determines the productivity of what you are doing and that is what i want to tell you today so i want you to go this week think of what you are doing think of what people think about you and get the best out of it if you need to work on yourself work on yourself if you need anything you can always ask questions thank you very much